Greetings and salutations, YouTube land. Prevail back at it with another unboxing video. Today I have something that's been a real hot minute since I've had in my hands. The latest Rassel box from Zobi. Featuring a retro attitude theme. So if you don't know, Shop Zobi's pretty much like the king of autograph companies right now. They do auctions, mystery boxes, custom t-shirts. And um, they have several different mystery boxes they do. They do a pop culture one, a horror one. I think there's some other... Oh, an anime one. And I can't even guess how often now they do the wrestling box. I'll be honest, this used to be more like your common mystery box. I know they used to have, like, Funkos in there. Um, you'd get a pin, sometimes a t-shirt. Last few have been less. Uh, this is $40, less if, if you're a Zobi supporter. Um, I, honestly, it's just, I think wrestling autographs have really started to rise up in value, so... It's probably gotten difficult for them to do a box at the price point they want, which I understand, but I miss my junk. All right. Let's get ready for the unboxing. Chop. Uh, hold on. I don't know if you need it. So, yeah, the retro attitude theme is kind of vague, honestly. I'm obviously I'm not expecting top names at forty bucks, especially with two autos. So up first we have a little thank you welcome card from Zobi. Always nice. Trying to make it so I can't see the autographs. I just said something flying. We have a sticker. Okay, that's actually really freaking cool. I thought it was just going to be a Zobi sticker, but we have the Brood in the Goblet of Blood. That is awesome. Well, this box is already a winner. See, these both have Zobi COAs. Well, I guess we'll go with those on top. And we have the Brooklyn Brawler, Steve Lombardi. Yeah. This man has had more gimmicks than I think anyone in wrestling. He was Kamala's handler, Kim Chi. He was Abe Knuckleball Schwartz, who I swear was called MVP at some point, but I can't find anyone else who remembers that. Do you? Is this like my crazy memory issue, or was that real? Not the most expensive autograph out there. You can usually get him pretty cheap. I had one of him, but honestly, the photo was kind of crappier than I realized. So, I'm glad to add him. Honestly, this man probably wrestled more major stars than, like, anybody on this planet. You should write, like, a memoir. I bet it'd be interesting. All right, so I'm assuming that's the retro, so let's see who the attitude is. We get Gangrel. I think I might have the same photo already. I think this is like the most common photo this man signs. Not horrible. Wasn't a huge star. Honestly, I think he could have been more. Well, you guys, we're probably sitting pretty close to that $40 mark. I don't think it, you know, went highly over, but not horrible, like I said. With what wrestling autographs are doing right now, it's tough. I personally would be willing to pay for a higher-end wrestling box. I mean, you guys see what I spend. <laughs> Honestly, out of all of this, I think the sticker is my favorite part. I need to buy another laptop so I have a cool place to put it. Just waiting for that echoing scream from my wife. 
Now, nah, this will go on one of my Aetolias. Yeah, I problem on any of those. I treat things with stickers the way people in their 20s are, like, treating tattoos. There's an inch of space. I gotta put something there. Maybe Ronald Reagan ice skating. Anyway. Hey, right, if you enjoyed this show, that thumbs up. Anything to say? Any comments? If you thought this box was crap, if you thought it was cool. If you got it and got something different, because sometimes they switch things up. Let me know down below. You know I love hearing from you guys. Ding that bell so we notified whenever my videos go live. Hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any videos. Giveaways. I do those. Got a big one just wrapping up. Might already have wrapped up by the time this goes live. I don't know. That's the problem with the future. Alright. As always, be excellent to each other. Party on, dudes. Want a drink?